Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. <laughs> What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Vax 14 tutorial and in this video I'm back with a new how to edit live videos like episode and in this video guys we're going to talk about Markiplier. Now first of all I want to mention that I'm not saying that you should uh, copy like exactly the same thing that he does because that's people always comments on those kind of videos like dude why don't you just you know make your own style and and you know things like that but people have been requesting markiplier on the pewdiepie videos on the leafy video on the scarce video so many other videos i did roman ed with larks case and Neistat. i also did videos of like how to edit like them and they would have been asking like can you please do markiplier so here you go so as you can see right now i'm i'm in vegas and what i did basically is i just recorded myself a really small part and i placed a minecraft picture underneath it so so that we can pretend that is the gameplay so first of all what we always have is a square so we're going to start off by making this from a rectangle to a square face cam now you can also do this in obs or you can do it afterwards in vegas so what we're going to do to make to get the square face cam is we go to event pen crop right here then we're going to pick mask at the very bottom as you can see uh, we're gonna just check that then we're gonna check this little icon and then we're gonna select a square around us as you can see like so so now that we have a square face scan well i need to check mask first there we go so as you can see right now we have a square face scan and that is basically how to get that one that part so now we can close that out and then we're gonna just go to the track motion uh, icon of the face cam track and we're gonna make this a little bit smaller like so and we're gonna place it in the corner on the left at the top so we're gonna place it right here as you can see so now that we have our face cam in the in the top left corner with also um, the gameplay underneath it we're gonna uh, like we can even add in like the foam how is it what is it called in english protection for you know, for canceling out you know the noise in his room we can also um apply that but only if you're sitting in front of a green screen like i am so what we're gonna do to you know add that little extra is just we're gonna go to uh, chroma key click on default drag it on top of there we're gonna just uncheck it for a second and then we're gonna just pick the blue bar pick this pencil then we're gonna click on on the green and now we can just apply the chroma key and we need to just play around with the low threshold and the high threshold to remove it there we go as you can see right there we have no background and what we're going to do now is we're going to go to google and we're going to find a picture of like those foam pads that he has on his wall so let's go over to google all right guys so now that we're in google what we're going to do is we're going to type in foam pads let's see if, if that is the right name i think it is so let's just pick a um picture of a wall or a room with you know those foam pads so i'm just gonna just scour around online to find um let's say isolated room let's see if i can you know pick it like that let's just pick foam like behind it foam i think this one looks pretty cool as you can see sound isolation so we're gonna just uh, pick for a little bit more realistic one i think i think this one is the best as we can get so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just save this image to our desktop right there now i'm gonna go back to uh vegas 14 and now i'm gonna drag in that image of that foam so i'm gonna go back to uh my desktop drag it on there and we're gonna create a new video track uh, underneath the, the you know the 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 green screen track so we're gonna place it right here as you can see right there and uh, let's just make it smaller until it fits underneath our face cam so we pretend that we are sitting behind uh like this sound isolation foam so let's place it like this make it a little bit bigger so you can place it right there two hours later and as you guys can see right now we have a sound isolation wall behind this and we have the game also and if i play back the video this is basically how it looks all right guys so this is going to be an example video of a face cam of markiplier so he always has his face cam in the top left corner i think in most videos while he is doing games or laugh trying to laugh challenges so basically this is just a really small clip to show you guys where to position where to position it on the screen 
Uh, so I would say make sure you just stay tuned and I would say let's go. So as you guys can see, that is how amazing it looks, guys. So that is how to add a like Markiplier, guys. Just put your face cam in the top left corner. If you have like a sound and isolation wall, just record yourself behind that, not behind the green screen. Uh, but this is one way how to do it. And like I said, guys, make sure to just get inspired by this and do not copy like the exact same thing he does because you guys like people have been commenting like so many times like you need to find your own style and everything but people have been asking me like how to edit like him so i decided why not make a video about it so that is it for this video guys thank you guys for the support we're almost at 90,000 subscribers we are only 89 subscribers away from 90,000. so thank you guys for that so i'm so super thankful so that's it for the video guys thank you guys for watching make sure to subscribe down below and also smash the like button down below let's go for 350 likes let's just try to go ahead and do that so that's it thank you Guys for watching i'll catch you guys tomorrow with a new episode of evolving into a better youtuber episode so i will see you guys tomorrow just alex halford